Hello, YouTube, Facebook, and Instagram family. My name is Lenisa King. Of course, you know that. I'm here to do a special video in regards to my hair. The title is How I Grew My Hair Back Using herbal recipes okay i've never shared this with you you guys have never once asked me what happened to your hair uh knowing how long it was back in 2017 when i first started youtube and then why now you know it's much shorter uh, well i went through so much with my health i even had to have some sort of iv uh, that was a strong medicine that literally started thinning my hair and then it was falling out. So I cut it off in 2020, uh, a lot of it. And then, so now I'm growing my hair back and it's pretty healthy. It's pretty healthy. It's just growing a lot. It's not as thick as it used to be, but um, we're getting there. Um, it's just really, really growing back. But anywho, uh, everything takes time, you know, nothing happens overnight. And so I think this is great progress. I'm doing my best to really take care of it. I've never had to do anything like this before in my life in regards to using special recipes, herbal recipes for my hair it just naturally grew. I've always had long, healthy hair. And so, but going through what I went through at one point, I remember I had this major surgery where I lost 25 pounds and I wasn't eating because I had no appetite. And so of course that will strip you of all your minerals and vitamins. And so when I began to eat um, and have a healthy appetite, uh, of course my hair started growing again. And so, yeah, so I went through a lot of things that caused um, thinning and caused my hair to fall out but yet here we are 2021 and god has done amazing things with my hair so in this video you will see all the three i share like three recipes with you that i've been using and i've done a lot of things but these are the three major ones that i wanted to share with you and then at the very end of the video i give you 15 tips to help you grow your hair and retain length retention so anyway we're gonna get started now okay starting with december the 26th of 2013 I'm here in a picture with my niece, and you see how long my hair was then, and then October 2013, same thing. That was the length of my hair, and then August 2014, I'm sitting here in my car, and you see how beautiful it is as well. June 2015, I'm here on a cruise ship with my husband, and we are celebrating our I think it was 26th anniversary, and my hair was so long, beautiful then. In 2016 with Jordan, the length of my hair still kept that length. In 2017, I am doing videos on YouTube, and another 2017 uh, pick here, the length was still beautiful, hair is still healthy. I've had long hair all of my life, you guys. In 2018 of March, same thing, my hair was curled a little bit, but you can still see the health and beauty of my hair. In 2019, you start seeing changes, drastic changes because of the IV medicine that I was on for my kidneys, having these diagnoses coming in, and uh, I literally had to cut my hair in 2020. And so this is what you see here that it was shorter. See the huge difference? This is 2021, October, this month. And so, yeah, there's a difference, huge difference. My hair is growing back. 2021, this was my birth date video on YouTube. And Clover Hairspray, this is the very first uh, herbal recipe I share with you how you need certain things like dry clothes, rosemary, fenugreek seeds, lavender, and that sort of thing. And here are all the things you need to do to make that recipe. It will be in the description box. So do not worry about 
uh, this at all, you will get it. And then I have an Indian recipe hairspray. I'm using organic neem powder, organic Tulsi powder, jasmine rice, purified water. And here again, I tell you what to do with these things. Now, this particular one, you have some things you need to do overnight. So make sure you have everything you need to make this before you start. And then also onion juice. That's my best recipe, you guys. And so it truly works. It stop hair thinning and breakage. So you want to make sure that you grab this information and learn how to make this. Then I leave you guys with 15 tips for your hair. I'm talking about massages on the scalp. I'm talking about if you use a hair dryer, uh, what you need to use prior to blow drying your hair like a thermal a heat protectant. I'm talking about so many things. Aloe vera gel. I tell you the herbal shampoo that I use is called Innate. Guys, I leave you with so much information. I tell you how to block DHT, the simple herbal ingredients that I use in my recipes. And so rice water is so powerful. So I actually share with you, uh, I talk a little bit about rice water, uh, during these 15 tips that I give you and so much more. So definitely get that information, grab it guys. You want to have this information because these things really work for my hair. You see that it is growing back and growing back thick and healthy. So I'm so happy about that because yes, with all the diagnoses that I was given, I was literally going through hair fall, you know, hair breakage. My hair was thinning, my hair was falling out too. So it was a hard time, but uh, these are some things that I learned from all of that. And we have all these things, a lot of these things in our households already in our kitchens. And it's just, you know, available to you uh, right there. So guys, I do a lot on YouTube. So I want you to take advantage of all the things that I share all the wisdom, knowledge, and understanding that I uh, provide for you through the videos when you're walking through your crisis situation. So I will talk to you soon. Thank you so much for joining me today. I love you so much. I'll talk to you later. Bye.